New at six, high school students banned from going to games. North Middlesex Regional High School says these teenagers behaved so badly they are no longer welcome in the stands. And that impacts everyone at the school. WBZ's Beth Germano has the story from Townsend. It just ruined it for us. It ruined the fun for all of us. Pick of Millsex over the red line. The fun of watching athletic events and cheering on your classmates. But the stands will now be pretty empty as students at North Middlesex Regional High School in Townsend have been banned from school games. And the principal says it's all about bad behavior. You know, if you act up, you get privileges taken away. It's not a right, it's a privilege. So I think it's kind of fair. A lot of kids are just like shocked and like mad about it. Because they think the school went too far? Yeah. yeah. School officials say actions have consequences, and they've repeatedly warned students to tone it down. But even some parents believe it's a drastic move. But maybe there's another way. Maybe um, if they could more pinpoint the kids. I don't know how difficult that would be. In a letter, school principal Timothy McMahon makes it clear, I have received far too many correspondences from a number of stakeholders regarding our student fans' inappropriate use of language, taunting behavior, and vulgarity at athletic contests. It's not the whole school that's doing it. It's just a few kids that are the problem. Yeah, and it's been like that for years. The only student fans who will be allowed at the games are siblings of athletes accompanied by their parents or junior varsity players traveling with varsity teams and have to sit in the stands until the games are over. You think this will teach a lesson? Of course. Yeah. You think so? You think they'll end up learning the hard yeah. way? Yeah, I think they will because everybody's bummed out. School officials will decide by February 1st if lessons have been learned or if the penalty will continue. In Townsend, Beth Germano, WBZ News.